the inspiration comes from uh, the English mystery writers of the early 20th century who were so very good at describing comfortable yet attractive rooms. And we wanted it to look as though someone really lived here, as though someone used the room. And dining rooms are the least used room in the house. So we thought we'd make it a multi-purpose room. So it's a dining room and a library at the same time. Well, we began with the rug as our first color. The rug is a uh, Tibetan rug from Stark. And the manager of the showroom, Steve Shrek, we were looking at Orientals. And he said, well, let me show you something else. And he brought this rug out. And that was absolutely the beginning of everything. And we thought we'd do red walls and didn't like that. And then I thought, well, I'm just going to go for it. Aubergine is the color. And it's a pharaoh and ball uh, color. They call it something else. But I'm really, really pleased with it. Just about everything in the room came from the design center. The chairs that are covered in ostrich leather, are fr which is actually not leather, it's vinyl, uh, are from Stark, and so is the fabric. The uh, chandelier over the dining room table is from Michael Cleary, as are uh, uh, this piece, uh, this mirrored console. The pair of lamps are from Vaughan, from the Heinz showroom. So it's um, the chairs behind me, wonderfully covered in, I think, in a faux kind of leopard, are from Lee. The linen-covered dining room chairs are also from Lee. I want them to feel as though they want to come into the room, that it's comfortable, that they feel at home here, that they find it's kind of peace, and would like to stay here and read a book, maybe, or have dinner. <laughs>